Hey buddy, you don't sound so good. What's going on? Oh, man on the floor. What's up YouTube? This is Print Practical. One of the funniest things about the Bamboo Labs printers, whether it's a P series or an X series, is that it has this poop chute in the rear of the printer and it just shoots filament out on your floor unless you have something to catch it in. My P1S has an AMS unit attached, so anytime it does a color change or it purges the nozzle on the beginning of a print, it shoots out a little nugget on the floor. I decided that I wanted to draw a small trash can that I'm gonna put behind my printer. Typically, I draw you know, practical parts in Fusion 360 and usually I have a bunch of dimensions and stuff. This is more of an artistic drawing, so I'm going to attempt to learn how to use Blender, which is a 3D modeling software and animation software. And I'm going to take a reference image, which I'll put on the screen now, and I'm going to try and design something that looks something like this. So I'm gonna start by trying to get the general shape of the trash can. So I start by adding a cylinder. Then I used a solidify tool to hollow it out, and I delete the top face. Now I'm going about cutting the cylinder so that I can extrude different parts of it. Here I'm making the rim. Now I'm shrinking down the bottom to give that little lip that you see at the midpoint of the trash can. Now I'm designing the handle. So I start out with a plane. I shape it somewhat what it's supposed to be and extrude it out. I use the ring cut tool again, which is going to create my handle eventually. Then I mirror it create the handle across, and then I'm gonna bevel it to make it look a little nicer. Then I gotta do some cleanup work. This is definitely not how you're supposed to do it, but this is what I came up with with my blender knowledge. And then I'm gonna mirror it across again, so that way I have handles on both sides. Do a few finishing touches by rounding off all the corners. And of course, I gotta add the Print Practical logo to the design to show that this was made on the channel. Blender allows you to export this model as an STL file, and since it's also an animation software, you can create cool animations. Thanks to Overture for sending me a roll of their white matte PLA. I'm going to use this to print out our model. I no longer have to worry about my P1S pooping on the floor because I got this cute little trash can now that's going to catch all of the filament purges that come out of the back of the printer. For all those guys that do their drawings in Blender, I have to give you some credit. That is very finicky and tough to use software, at least for me, coming from a Fusion 360 background. This was my first experience with Blender and I think this thing came out pretty nice. So that's it for this one. I'm going to throw this model up on Thingiverse and throw a link down in the description below. Subscribe to the channel and like the video. Thanks for watching.